All right, you're probably wondering why me and Chappie are making a video in my car. We're going down to the store, Quick Connect, a local PC place, to pick up my new rig. Oh yeah, Del is Gaming. 4K? What? Streams? YouTube videos? The hype is real. Okay, this is Chris with Quick Connect here in Nebraska. Chris, can you talk about the rig? Yes, I uh, built this computer for a. Uh... For Mr. J, and uh, I just wanted to uh, pop the top before he uh, took it home. I'm a little grown, a little attached to the computer, so a little sad to see it go. Oh, let's see this thing. I love the case. All right, so let's be very careful lifting this up here. Let me show you around the rig. So, anyway, um, let me get a flashlight so you can see inside a little bit better. Oh, look at those graphics cards. All right, so those graphics cards are absolute monsters, okay? They're Titan X, and we have them running an S dual SLI. Um, this motherboard has the ability to add another one down the road if you want to have triple SLI, but you know, this is pretty good, this is pretty good. All right, so anyway, we've got a sealed water cool system, which really keeps, it has a radiator right there, really keeps it quiet. It's got 32 gig of DDR4 RAM that is overclockable if, if you wanted to. Um, it's got a USB 3.1, which is actually like a brand new thing just out. Uh, which is a step above 3.0, okay. which is fast USB. It's got a Supernova 850 watt power supply, modular of course, so you can add extra mo uh, extra ports if yeah, you want. Yeah, add the extra graphics card. Yeah, it's got uh, it's got a sixth generation Core i7, which is absolutely ridiculous. This is the first uh, sixth generation CPU that we built in the shop. Um, so we're pretty proud of that. Uh, for the OS drive, it's got a Samsung 850 Pro SSD, which you know a standard SSD is way different than the Pro, and the Pro is top of the top of the echelon. Low loading screens, I like it. Uh, yeah, yeah, and it's got it's set to it's got different settings that you can set it to either maximum reliability or maximum performance. At the moment, I have it set for maximum reliability, but if you wanted to adjust the settings, you could set it to maximum. Okay. Performance, but you know, you're, it's only be a millisecond. So I would prefer the, to err on the on the side of reliability. It's uh, for the data drive. It's got a four terabyte um, hybrid SSD drive, which is basically a ra regular platter style drive with a with a cache that's SSD. So it helps it run much faster. All right. So we're going back downstairs after we got the rig from Quick Connect doing a little impromptu uh, video here. As you see, Sheppy, he's angry, but he was being loud, so we can't have him down here. Okay, welcome to the basement. Yes, and all of its nerdy glory. Here's a brainstorming YouTube videos area. There's my little PS4 and little area that I, if I had friends, they would come over and hang out, but they're all online. I don't have any real life friends. Here's my old nerdy area for my little collectibles and some old school video games to prove. Look at that. Look at that. That's nerd reading right there, people. I'm that crazy. Okay, here's my little collectibles. When Cheppy really makes me mad, I get this sword and I run around with them. My little lightsaber. And here is the area where I stream and spend a lot of my time. Got my green screen, a couple lights. You notice those camera lights. I have my mic here and my headphones. So the big thing to me is that I wanted to improve my audio quality. And so what I did was I took the PC and put it back here. Now, I'm too poor to do really uh, fancy drywall and put sound editing stuff in there right now. You know, maybe when I have 2 million subs, I'll do that. I don't know. But anyways, I got the computer here. You can just hear it's The fan in the background is louder than this computer, especially running in full blast. You can see all the fans here. It's extremely quiet, and the case has never been. Uh, it's unbelievably cool. So I have the wires going through here. And with that open mic and kind of an enclosed space, it sounds so much better. So if I took tur this little fan off here, you can almost hear the cricket going in the back. Can you hear it? Can you guys hear it? That's crazy. It's gonna be so much better audio quality. And so I'm playing on this monitor here, Republic of Gamer. Uh, let me get this off. Remind me later, no, I'm not watching porn. Don't get any fancy ideas. Okay, so I got this guy. You don't want to see my face. 
Look at this thing. This thing is fantastic. So this is my area. It's like playing a brand new game. I'm going to go in game and do some videos of it. But guys, this is like playing a brand new game. It runs so buttery smooth. One millisecond response time, but the G-Sync is what makes the difference. The G-Sync means it keeps that frame rate in the graphics card. Card, two, Titans, extremely buttery smooth. So I'm hoping the result is I'm going to be able to do better YouTube videos, higher resolution at 60 frames a second, and not have any dropped frames. Buttery smooth, so these ESO videos are like crisp. Let's go in game. A little video clip of me rolling around in what I think is the coolest area in the game, Stone Falls. As you can see, it's visually striking. And the amount of detail in the frames are just spectacular. I absolutely love it, and especially the detail that you get with the colors and the vibrancy. It's just, it's awesome. It's like playing a whole new game. The lighting, it's, I, I don't know, it's fantastic. It's worth every penny, and I'm excited about the future of gaming to see what other things have to offer. Maybe even install The Witcher 3 and see what that looks like. So yeah, that that begs the question, why did I even get a new computer in the first place? So for those of you that don't know, Mrs. Delty is pregnant with our first child and we're very excited. About 10, 12 weeks along, things are going great and I wanted to make a huge investment towards the future of my gaming and my business, continuing to cover games, uh, making videos and being able to run Drex X12 in the future, having monster graphics cards, basically everything I need to be able to play games for probably next three to five years. So as I'm told, babies are very, very expensive. So I want to be prepared that I don't have to have a huge, large uh, payment for something that, you know, is related to my job. And that's providing good information for you. The future of me in Delta's gaming, I still plan to play on Elder Scrolls Online, but I probably will expand to Fallout 4 um, right around the corner. And so look forward to seeing guides from that. I'm pretty much going to go all in on that game and see if I like it. Hopefully their multiplayer is, there's a multiplayer component of it, because if there's not, I'm not going to stick with it for a year or so. But until then, still going to play Elder Scrolls Online, enjoy it, and learn everything else I can about it providing you great guides. So thank you so much. Because of you watching this video, I'm allowed to live my dream. And Baby D, wish me luck.